Alright, so we're back with the only game where you can build a road that takes so long to traverse that you will die of old age before you reach your house. It's City Skylines. Florida has a problem. People keep coming here to die. See this guy right here? Probably coming to retire in Florida. However, Florida man has discovered a plan to keep Florida pristine and still every bit as depressing as it is right now. What if the road into Florida was so obnoxious that just getting to the end of it would take an entire lifetime? So my plan today is to take the road here and make it so that it is so impossible to navigate in a timely fashion that people who come onto it will die, like as human beings, <laughs> before they reach the end. There's a couple of problems with this, however. City Skylines does it like length. Girth is fine, length is no good. If your road is too long, eventually it'll stop spawning creatures to try and traverse it. But that's fine, I have a plan. You know when you're downtown driving and you just need to get to Starbucks or something like that, it's like 100 feet away. But for whatever reason, the city planning decided to put 700 different red lights in front of you and you hit every single one, they're all timed, so that you hit every single one, that's what we're gonna do. Welcome to You're Gonna Die of Old Age Highway. Okay, so it's time to see just how many red lights people will accept in this game. Now, I'm not a monster. Okay, I'm gonna at least give them some trees to look at while they sit in traffic for the rest of their entire lives. I'm also kind of curious, like, how close you can put these roads together. Oh, sh Please close up the hole to the underworld. Thank you, God. Okay. So what we have here is a sad little intersection. Now normally this intersection is pathetic in that it doesn't actually stop anyone from doing anything. Luckily though, we can put down a traffic light. I don't really know if it matters how long- oh my god. <laughs> Very long green and red phases, extremely short green and red phases. It's just a matter of how much whiplash you want to give people. Okay, so the very first traffic light is set up. Now there's a problem with this. Typically, because there's no traffic coming this way, people will just continue to go through the traffic light. It is the traffic light that all of us dream of, but none of us ever get. It's a traffic light that is literally forever green. However, because, because we love torturing human beings, what you can do is you can force people to turn. Now what you have here is you have the beginning of making people want to kill themselves. See, everyone has to stop at the red light, then they have to go down this sad little street, then they have to do a U-turn while popping all their tires on the, uh, the curb there, then they have to wait for this red light. Apparently they're gonna wait for this red light for a long ass time, and then finally they get to continue down the roadway. Now, we just have to do this about six billion times. This seems like one of those things where I'm gonna want to save right away. Now obviously everyone needs a reason to go through all this pain. Here we go. All the way at the end. They can get some of our world famous Florida cocaine dogs. Florida man approved. Oh. Uh. Now we have to keep these fairly short too. Cause like I said, you make this stuff too long, the computer gets smart. It understands that you're trying to torture it and it won't allow it to happen. Great, one of my danglers is crooked. Eh, no one will notice. Let me tell you something. I've been at this for a while. You wanna know something real sad though? I'm nowhere near done. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All the future retirees are watching and they're wondering what, what will hold out longer? My resolve to torture people, the budget for the city, or if they get lucky, maybe they'll die before I complete this. Oh God. It has begun. I may actually be able to make this a little bit worse. Let me just check something real quick here. <laughs> yes, do it, do it. Oh yeah, this is much better. The legendary tales will go on of like old people talking to one another and they're gonna be like, did you get to Florida before or after the death road reform? And the other guy will be like, well, I'm still alive, so it was before. Oh my God. And I thought that farming simulator tested my masochism levels. You gotta understand, this is how much we've done. 
that's only how far along we are. I've got another two thirds of this to go at the very least. Okay, I think I've got the copy and paster working so I don't have to feel like I'm gonna kill myself doing this. Every once in a while, you know, get a little something like this, but I'm sure it'll be fine. It's Florida, they'll figure it out. What the hell happened over here? What the hell is this? I didn't do this. The world has started to fight against me. <laughs> oh, sh what the hell just, what is this? I just did a copy and paste and the whole universe decided to, to just flip out. You know what? Whatever. Oh, sure. We are breaking the game in all sorts of glorious ways today. Okay, we're about halfway down so far. Let's see if they'll accept this at least. I can feel people's will to live being drained for them, from their bodies as they see all of these lights going in right now. I'm gonna test this so far. This is gonna be my stopping point. This way I'll know what I haven't messed with yet. Gotta change all these too because the freaking game doesn't want to recognize it unless I do it all by hand. Oh God, yes. Oh, it's glorious. Okay, it is working. I just have to stick it out. <laughs> I appreciate that eventually the game just stopped naming the streets. How many traffic lights? All the traffic lights. Okay, I just got to the end of this go. More than halfway there. I figured out what I'm naming this place. Carpal Tunnel Syndrome Dale. Masochism level 9,000. Oh, thank you, baby Jesus. Okay. <laughs> the entire highway <laughs> is absolutely filled. Now I just have to remember where the hell I stopped making lights. Look at this. Look at this horror. It's just a never ending corridor of lights. The plot twist to this is this road actually isn't going to kill the people coming into Florida. It's going to end up killing me. These red lights are colored red from the blood of my ancestors at this point. It's taken so long. I'm not actually the same YouTuber anymore. I'm actually Gray's son. I took over for him. <laughs> Made it. <laughs> now I get to go through the fun of changing all the lanes so that they go the direction that I need to make this as long as inhumanly possible. This entire endeavor has been so pointless that Florida man would be proud. Okay, little over halfway done. Getting all the markers here completed. That moment when you want to see how far you've gotten, but you really don't because you're afraid of how much is left and you know it's gonna be totally demoralizing to see how much you still need to do. Oh yes. Sweet Jesus. <laughs> now I just have to change the turn lanes. Something that I never thought about when I started this was just how much my masochism meter will be tested. Don't worry everyone, I'm more than halfway there. I like how my roads are so screwed up at this point that people aren't even trying anymore. This guy's just driving on the gravel. He's like, you know what? Kill me. I think I know what this is now. I, I think they're just trying to run into my light post. They're just trying to end it. But Gray, why is he trying to end it? He's almost, he's almost finished. No, see, that's, that's what you don't understand. You realize this has to go back where it came from, right? Oh, thank you God. Okay. I actually had to go through and double check these because I hadn't experienced enough pain yet. Oh, okay. There we go. Ah, uh, the roads of Satan. There we go. Go ahead and have it offload over here. All right. Then it comes all through here to get back going the other way. All of the lights are now completed. Now I know what you're saying. You're saying gray. This looks absolutely awful. You realize it can get worse, right? Speed limit's 100 kilometers per hour here. <laughs> Ready for this? There we go. Change all those to 10 kilometers per hour. Highway, 100 kilometers per hour. Not in my world. There we go. Hey, how do you enjoy that? Does it feel good? Is this what you always wanted? <laughs> He's a tourist. He's leaving the city. He's like, oh my God, what have I done? 
I was uneducated my whole life and this is where it's gotten me. So, um, the year is 3-11-2019. How long do you think it'll take him to get out? Oh, he's on Make It Stop Street. Well, I don't know how this happened, but that's a problem. Um, take number two, just without the watery apocalypse. All right, now, since we have our ultimate death road, you've got to have people that live here after all. I don't know why anyone would live here on purpose, but you know what? We're at the point where we do whatever we want anyway, so they're all residential. <laughs> if ever there was a time when the game is going to break, <laughs> this is it because each one of these streets <laughs> can support a house. Oh my God. Okay, here's the plan. Every other person has given up the will to live except for <laughs> this garbage truck. We're all the way at the beginning. It's time to find out just how long it takes the garbage truck to go through the entire circuit and then end up back over here so it can go back home. <laughs> all right, it's 8 to 2020. Let's see just how big your balls are, biofuel garbage truck. Over a year has freaking passed. This agony will never end. <laughs> Don't worry, man, you can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> I'm actually kind of curious how desperate this guy was to take this job. Just doing our best over here to remind you guys to recycle. I really appreciate that the slums are continuing to propagate like all down this entire highway of hell. Oh, you know what? That reminds me too. Hold on. So it's been a year and a half so far. That's the beginning. <laughs> so we're like not even a third of the way done. <laughs> Literally two hours later. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, I left for like two hours and I came. It's been like six years. <laughs> and we're only at the halfway point. This is the turnaround. So now it has to go the other way. It's been, it's 2026 on Carpal Tunnel Syndrome Dale. This guy's been driving for like six years at 10 kilometers per hour. I figured out what this is. This is punishment for prisoners. You know, not the garbage collecting. The prisoners are like, oh, I just got to collect garbage. That doesn't sound that bad. No, it's not. You don't collect garbage. You just drive the truck. Okay, that's all forever. You drive the truck until you die. This person's gonna be on the road for like 10 or 12 years before he finally gets back. Yeah. That's what you got to look forward to still. It's a war zone of dead houses and depression. Because I made the, the road so slow, like the entire map is just one giant gridlock. Literally another two hours later. Rosemary Miller Street. I never thought I would eventually see you. It's been 12 years. I think it's been more than 12 years. But finally, after all this time, we're finally at the start of, of the original area over here. <laughs> Come on, for the love of God, just finish this up. You're so close. You're coming to the end of your prison sentence. This is all culminated to this point where you finally get the opportunity to go home to your family. Oh, <laughs> I've been screwed around with the roads to get more like people to come into the city. <laughs> so he took the long way around. It would have been shorter if you just went up and down these roads and finished things up. And there it is. Finally, back at the beginning of the city, I think. So good for him. There you go. 12 years of pain that people had to go through. 12 years of this. Haven't checked my Twitter in 380. Who should I call if no one shows up to pick up the dead? <laughs> yes. That's so perfect for this entire episode. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of City Skylines. We've been playing for so long that global warming is finally starting to kick in. Anyway, till the next time, stay foxy, much love.